Hello everyone, it's Envious Games here, and welcome back to Forever Stranded, episode 22, where we're yet again in the nether, uh, dying a lot. Well, I'm in the nether dying a lot. <laughs> and apart from that, let's just get right into the video. Alright. I need to I only just died myself while mining out this obsidian. <laughs> Okay, um, the good thing is we are free from the overworld mobs. That's something we don't have to deal with. At least that much. The bad news is now we're dealing with nether mobs. <laughs> yeah, now we're dealing with all of the nether mobs. <laughs> okay, well, I need some more food. On the bright side, out of making this room, I'm getting a lot of obsidian. Good. We'll need it to make the cooling coils. Yeah, obsidian is does seem to have a common theme of being a valuable resource that we might need. Huh. Hypothermia, my old bed. Uh, I haven't gotten it this whole like this whole three episodes that we've recorded tonight. Like we have actually almost dying of hy hypothermia. Nice. <laughs> Hypothermia? Oh wait, hyperthermia or hyperthermia? Hypothermia. You know, cold. Wow, I haven't been cold in- God, I haven't been cold in forever. I know, right? <laughs> We're always facing hyperthermia. <laughs> We're always heating up. So used to just jumping into a pool. But I, but I know if I do that right now, I'm just gonna die. You know, make another- make a lava pool or something. <laughs> no. Oh god. <laughs> uh, hi, Blaze. What's good? You don't need to be here. I can't. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Copper ore, when uh, pulverized, has a chance of making gold. Okay, that's a problem. There's a, there's a Blaze right in my base of operations here. Uh. That fucking dick. Leave me alone! Okay, it hurt one of his friends. They're gonna get like a fight now. No, they're not. One of them's in one of my grinders and can't get out. Oh, there's two in the grinders. And trapped him now. I might want to make a safety net over here for myself. Before it kills me. What's good? What is good, buddy? Got him. What? It can't see me. What is hitting me? Nice. What is hitting me, dude? Wow. Okay, well I just game ended some blazes. That's good. But it is hard to survive over here. <laughs> ah! It could just see me. We might have to resort to slabs over there because they have a they have such a range over there. I like how this chest is almost completely full of my death notes. No, I don't think I need this water here anymore. I doubt there's any more lava. <laughs> I wouldn't make too many conclusions too soon, buddy. I know, but I basically fully drained out this pit. Yeah. Okay, well, at least I can sprint over there. There was just a blunt bunch of blunch. Oh, wow. Oh, God, there's a blaze, and I don't have a weapon or blocks on me. This is going to end well. <laughs> and it sees me. Hey, buddy, what's good? Can you fall for me? Hmm, what should I call this room? 
What are you gonna call that room? Good, it's falling. It fell! Let's go! It, uh, stopped seeing me and it fell. There's this random chisel bit of copper ore. Oh yeah, that was me when I was first. <gasps> no, go away! <laughs> go away, go away, go away. No one wants you. Go away, please. I wonder if I put it back into the ore, will it go back to being a regular old copper block? Yep. Nice. Wait, if you put it... Oh. It's right there. Oh yes! Good pigmen. The pigmen act as a giant acted as a giant buffer for me. Dude, there's Yeah. It was blocking the skeleton so I could hit it. Since the since the wither skeleton is one block taller, I could hit it off the void and the and the and the pigmen was slowing it down. Pigmen, I need you again. Ah, there's a blaze and a skeleton. What is this? Okay, it seems to be too dumb to jump blocks. Oh, I say that now. I say that now. I say that now. Go away. And there's a blaze too. There's a blaze too. I'm hitting it with my fist. Because <laughs> I was trying to combat blazes. God, this is... So painful for me. Okay. A again, at least my stuff doesn't despawn. Keep in mind, I'm doing all of this without sprinting at all. Because I can never get up en enough food. Uh, walking over. Walking back over to the porches where I'm probably gonna die again. So what I'm planning on doing is making like a giant grinder pit down there so that everything falls into it and I can just kill everything at once. Sounds like a good plan. But the thing is, uh, actually doing that. <laughs> True. I want to pulverize this thread because we're going to need that for the uh, energy storage unit. Okay, there's a compressed skeleton up there. Fun. Yeah, come over here a little bit more over the void, and now I'm gonna block myself in. Hmm. It's seriously working in my favor how dumb the bot AI is for the blazes. <laughs> okay, but this blaze is sort of in my way. If there's one thing I don't like about blazes, it's the fact they can be like snipers at times. Yeah. Like you're out like a hundred blocks away from the fortress, and they still shoot you with a random fireball while you're mining. Oh my god, that is a compressed skeleton. Imagine a compressed blaze. Dude, stop giving mod developers an idea. <laughs> Don't take it seriously, devs. Don't. <laughs> there are really enough hell as is. Okay, that's good. There's enough blazes down there that just fell. Okay. And why do I have enough power to complete this last ore? Or will I not have enough power? Um... Okay. Watch this. Chad move here. Chad move. Okay. Okay. So basically, if you don't know the compressed uh, skeleton, if you kill it and if you kill it by hand, and if it dies, it will multiply by a lot, and I just knocked it into the void. And that one just died. Okay, that's a skeleton. You can die. Okay, I'm brought to a. Ah! I think in this entire time that we've been here, I've made one trip back, and that's it, dude. There's a magma cube up there now? What? Wow, they're just not doing you right, bruh. Oh, dude, come on, no. Don't do that to me. Dude, 
Surely, surely you can't out jump me. <laughs> this is very repetitive. Go away. I know if you downsize, you'll fall. <laughs> ah! The pigmen are a good buffer for the wither skeletons, though. Because the wither skeletons can't get past them, and it's a one-block bridge. We might want to install some walls. And some booby traps, if you know what I mean. Um, oh, I just have enough lead to make the energy cell. Yeah, guys, come over here. So lucky I'm a master with the thermal series stuff. Like I know the uh, Dude, they are mad. Anything, anything thermal you could ask me, I know the shit. Dude, they are mad. They are really Hi! Um <laughs> Hello there! I just mined that one block and there was... Oh god. Dude, this is not good. No! I am overrun. Dude, I am so overrun. What's wrong? There's so many blazes. Oh, uh, there's a blood moon. Okay, well, I'm in the nether. I don't know if it has an effect in the nether. Better pray it doesn't. I didn't get the message, so... I'm just gonna assume. Do you wanna take that risk? <laughs> Although, there does seem to be a sudden increase in mobs. <laughs> How is there a blood moon in the nether? There is no... There's no moon. Dude, I am listening to so many fireball noises now. Right now. It's like minigun firing. But it's just fireballs. A minigun okay. with fireballs. Okay, so apparently blazes can fire through walls. That just hacks. That is, yeah, I'm calling hacks on these blazes. <laughs> Got fucking aimbot. Uh! Dude, these blazes are using reach, I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> that is the most reach I've ever seen. <laughs> ah! Dude, I don't know how I'm meant to do this. Big man, I'm sorry, but you need to move. I'm trying to avoid placing more blocks outward as possible because that gives, like, blaze and more nasty mobs to spawn. So I'm trying to avoid that as much as I can. Alright, I've now connected the flux deck. No, 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 no. I did not hear that noise. I don't want to hear that noise. What Where noise? is it? I heard a ghast. Oh, God. Where is it? <laughs> I'm going to start working on the, uh, whatchamacallit. The... I can't think for shit right now. Oh, yeah, they, uh, Redstone furnace. Let me get back in, let me get back in. What's good? Hello. Okay. 
Got my stuff back. Damn it, we don't have clay. Oh. We have to wait all night for a blood moon. What? Ugh, dang, it's not enough clay though. It's only four. I need a whole nother four for a thing of bricks. Got it. There's another death point. And there's all the good stuff. Okay. Wait, since when do we have like an entire stack of coal in that chest about the furnaces? That's always been that. Oh no, I hit a pig man. Why didn't anyone tell me this? I didn't know it was there. <laughs> okay, well, now when I go out on the bridge, the pig men are going to be mad at me. Well, I wish you luck there. I'm gonna need it. I hope the rice is ready for harvest. Alright, thank god. The funny thing is that in thermal, there is a machine that can be used to grow crops rapidly. Nice. Yeah, it also produce like an extra abundance. I got sulfur, by the way. Nice. Sulfur. What? Well, that, that can be used for something. I know it for sure. Sticky keys. Why? Okay, so I just discovered something that. The large-scale grinder that I mentioned earlier is going to be a bit harder than I first anticipated. Which means I'm going to have to go up there and do everything manually. So... We have two compressed zombies above our bunker. Um... Great. <laughs> Uh, one, I hope I can do. Uh, that's a blaze. Hello. I hate how I have to do this in so low health. Okay, so we see it. So we need two brick blocks. A reception coil machine frame, which means we need tin. Let's see if we have any of that. Blaze, come over here. Iron, we have that. Uh oh, I learned how to fight. Um. Okay, you can fall now. Okay, there's one down. One of many. And I hear a witch. Compressed witch? Question mark? <laughs> nah, it just seems to be like a regular witch. Which is a good thing. Jesus Christ, it sounds like a war zone in here. Hold on, I'm gonna turn off the output for a second, just to do it. Okay, I turned up the output. Here we go. Just put an ear rape warning in your video. <laughs> okay, I'm definitely heating up, so I'm gonna need to do something about all this fire. Dude, there is so many blazes right now. I swear to God. We're on the bright side now, it's day. Which means I can go get the clay I need. Okay. I'm trading so many hits though. Okay, a compressed zombie just burned. Good. 
It does me a solid. Okay, I don't care how long this takes to eat. I'm still doing it. I don't care. I need to. Oh no! I just fell. What's up? Now the pigmen are gonna be mad at me, but hey, it's fine. Okay, the gas appeared to have left. Oh no, are those pigmen gonna be mad at me now? I hope not. I don't think they were in range to. Pigmen, are we chill? I'm sort of having a problem with mobs. Okay, these ones are chill. Will I make this jump? No. It's supposed to, it's gonna be like a running jump, but I don't know if I'll make it or not. And then I'd have to time it properly to get my climb back. I cut that close to that place. <gasps> uh, and I failed. <sighs> Sorry, right, zombie, you gotta go. Oh god! That was so close to being me. All right. Let me do it. Old copper armor. What is this? What are you? What are you? Okay, good. You're just a you're just a pig man. But I'm sorry, you have to go. I apologize, but you must. I have to get the. Coin. Oh no! I hit it! I hit it! I hit it! <laughs> Uh, but guys, on the doorstep of this nether, um, this is gonna do it for this episode, episode 22. Again, I've been dying for three episodes straight here, so I hope you enjoy the content. Apart from that, that's gonna do it from this video.